Somerville, a small town in the middle of Boston's metropolitan area, the second fastest growing economic center in the USA after Silicon Valley is faced with significant challenges. Due to urban redevelopment, a new thriving city center will spring up in this area over the coming years. The expansion of mobility infrastructure is very important for the development of districts like Union Square. This, and the fact that 43% of Somerville's population is aged between 18 and 34, makes it an ideal testing ground for the future of urban mobility. We hope that Somerville will be the world model how we open up a community for exploration. What type of technologies will we bring to bear to make the automobile smarter? Can we have smarter parking structures as we plan the future development of districts like Union Square? Together with specialists like Philip Parsons, urban planner and former dean at Harvard University, and strategic consultant Jane Corneal, Audi technicians have analyzed the area surrounding Union Square and developed smart mobility solutions. Solving the parking problem is an important factor. Approximately 30% of traffic during rush hour is caused by people looking for a parking space. This can be reduced once cars start parking themselves automatically, since parking garages can accommodate far more self-parking cars than conventional ones, on-street parking spaces can be relocated indoors. In addition, parking garages exclusively designed for self-parking cars can be moved to the second tier. People can leave their cars in a dedicated drop-off area, from which the cars drive themselves to a remote parking garage. This spares the search for a free parking space and saves the driver a lot of time. Audi's technology makes it possible to use 30% more space in the Union Square area for housing, offices, shops and public space. In addition, Car2x technologies like Traffic Light Information Online can accelerate the flow of traffic. Traffic light information online is a first step to smart flow, which means cars get the information from the infrastructure about the optimum speed the driver should use to ride a green wave. This is just a unidirectional information. In the future, we will have a bidirectional information exchange with the cities. In the medium term, Audi plans to set up a central traffic management system in cooperation with Somerville and anticipates traffic flow to increase by 20 to 50 percent.